so recently I came across some research about a word that all of us, including me for sure, say way too often. Studies show that people in the UK can say it eight times a day, women usually more often than men. The research also shows that people will think a little bit less of you if you say this word too often, and the word is this, sorry. Now, let's be clear, apologizing is an important thing to do if you have a good reason to do it. But when you say sorry reflectively, sorry, can I speak? Sorry, I don't agree. Then you're weakening yourself and you're weakening your message. And I have TED speaker Maya Yovanovitch to thank for having pointed this out to me. So if sorry makes you weaker, what should you say instead? Here are some suggestions. The first one is, excuse me. Excuse me is great if you bump into somebody in a doorway, for instance. It's not 100% clear who bumped into who, but some people will say sorry no matter what. Just say, excuse me and go on your way. A second great thing to say that I think is really smart in some situations is this. Thank you. Yovanovitch recounted a time when she was sitting in a restaurant waiting with two other people for a fourth person who was late for a business meeting. And she was waiting to see how he was going to apologize for having held up his important colleague's time. Well, he walked in and said, thanks for waiting for me, guys. And that was it and they went on with their meeting. It puts you equal with the other person, and that's important. And the last thing, although it may be the hardest thing, is there are times when you might want to say sorry, and what you should really say is nothing at all. So if you find yourself at work or in life apologizing for things when you know you really shouldn't, you know you really have nothing to apologize for, think about this. You're putting yourself in a weaker position. You're telling the other person, I'm not as good, as important, or as powerful as you. And if you do that over and over again throughout your day, they might start to believe it.